Well, she's been a respected stalwart of Australia's news community for decades now, distributing money to the masses and allowing the viewing public to suckle from her udder filled with sweet, milky entertainment. But how much do we really know about the cash cow? Matteo Mazzella has more. The Sunrise Cash Cow, a beloved Australian icon that has changed the lives of many citizens, taking money from the rich and giving it back to the rich. However, a recent ACC investigation revealed the celebrity bovine has been siphoning off prize money and laundering cash for organised crime. Her physical features have deteriorated rapidly and was recently charged for assaulting a patron at a bar in South Yarra. Once beloved by so many citizens, has now become a menace to society. So where did it all go wrong? We followed Cash Cow throughout an ordinary day, revealing her meetings with black market fishmongers, buying cocaine to sell, or for her own personal use. We may never know. They also may be discussing possible child trafficking schemes, for all we know. I confronted Cash Cow in her dilapidated Melbourne home, just in time before she left, to possibly leave for China to maybe harvest organs for self-profit. Cash cow, my uh, uh, Just calm down, okay? Uh, hey! Uh, she damaged our equipment in an unprovoked attack and declined to be interviewed. Cash cow, my name's Matteo from The League. Do you have time to talk about your allegations and rumours of child trafficking and organ harvesting? With little to no journalistic integrity, I decided to break into the cash cow crack den, along with my cameraman. I would like to advise viewers not to try this at home. Try on a property you don't own instead. managed to walk in with ease, and what we found may not surprise you. Mateo Mazzella, Philly.